Getting a, a flight, say for example, to Europe, it doesn't happen overnight. It's years in the making, and it's years in the making to, to keep those flights as well. And all that hard work is paying off for the team at San Antonio International Airport. Our airport is now offering more than 40 nonstop destinations, and city leaders are looking to add more routes. Tiffany Huertas looks into the importance of air connectivity and what passengers would like to see more of. Uh, I'm going to visit some family. Jesse Lopez is traveling from San Antonio to Guadalajara, Mexico. As a frequent flyer, he wants to see more nonstop destinations. More direct flights to any destination, really. San Antonio International Airport offers more than 40 nonstop destinations, with the first nonstop flight to Europe starting in May. There's a lot of opportunities. Tim O'Crongley, Deputy Aviation Director for the City of San Antonio, explains what this new flight to Frankfurt means for our community. The economic benefit that you get from it, it's not only the direct benefit from the flight, but it's who will come here, what will be invested in the future, what will we take you know, to Europe. Uh, it, it's really a launching point for additional economic development for San Antonio and the region. O'Crongley says air connectivity is important for a community. The airport is a very large economic generator. And with today's mobile society, the way airports move people and traffic and goods, it's really a life hub of a community. What type of infrastructure are companies looking for at an airport? They, they want to make sure we have good connectivity, you know, routes and, and, and that kind of opportunities, but also other infrastructure you know terminals represent the community so they're the first thing you see when you arrive and last thing you see when you leave the airport was recently awarded 30 million dollars in grants from the federal aviation administration for upgrades to terminal a and for a new terminal that opens in 2028. This is the site of our future new terminal. O'Crongley says the new terminal will be added here a 17-gate facility, approximately 850,000 square feet. More opportunity for new airlines, existing airlines to expand. Uh, we'll have concession programs. You know, they're all for local jobs. Last year, about 10.7 million passengers passed through San Antonio International Airport. And with this new project, they hope to exceed those numbers in the future. So we broke tra uh, passenger records and we look forward to continuing that trend. And that's why we're preparing the airport for the future based on those forecast demands and being able to serve our citizens. Tiffany Huertas, KSAT 12 News. Keep up to date with all of San Antonio's top news, weather, and so much more by clicking the like and subscribe buttons below. And once again, thanks for watching KSAT.